Yo, bus invaders. I'm Sean from Yellow Card. Come on up. We want to show you the the rolling Yellow Card house. Here we have a uh, beautiful 2008 XL2 with slide out. I was just making sure that all of my uh, Star Wars DVDs were in, in order. Can't leave home without these. In fact, I think there are three members of our crew who have never seen a single one of these films, which is absolutely blasphemy. This is also this is the first bus we've been on in five years that has had the slide out that Sean was just talking about. So huge advantage. It's so much more comfortable. So much space for activities. We have a drummer, Longitude Parsons, that comes with the bus. He's, he's with us all the time. We're gonna get right into the uh, to the necessities here. Uh, occasionally, this is the, the fridge is built in here. So uh, we have limited space, but occasionally we'll do the Walmart or the Target stop. You know, your, your microwave pizza, your uh, cinnamon liqueur. Um, of course, the condiments, very necessary. That's all you this, need. This I was is, just going to say, really, all you need is the sriracha. This is important, the sriracha, to light any, uh, any palate on fire. A variety of juices and milks, iced coffee. Some leftovers, you know, we don't, don't let the leftovers go too long. But uh, this is actually really important here. This is where, this is where dad, magic happens. This is where dad keeps all his stuff. <laughs> so just some party favors, you know, glass bottles Gentle containing. Gentlemen's drinks. Gentlemen's drinks. Gentlemen's, Gentlemen's drinks. drinks. Gentlemen's drinks. Gentlemen's also have the, uh, some wine, some open, and also uh, some Baileys, you know, just for a hot toddy or something on a chilly winter day like today in Chicago. We found this honey on the bus when we got on it. It's uh, apparently it's Stevens honey. Uh, we don't know if there's any LSD or, or marijuana or anything or some crazy substance cooked or, or, or how would you say, I don't know, brewed into this honey. But I use it and I feel great. So thanks Steven for your honey. These are pretty essential for tour. Try not to drink uh, as I was just sipping on a Red Bull. I didn't know this was in here. Try not to drink too many Red Bulls. Not that this is a whole lot better for you, but uh, it's really nice to have a five hour energy before the show. Well, as you can see here, <coughs> this is our bathroom. You know, it's uh, it's perfect, nice. You got the like little stone looking, you know, wall in there for, you know, better ambiance kind of thing and the lights, which look really nice. Nice mirror for people. If you have your ladies out, you know, they can do their hair and makeup in there. Back here, you've got our bunk area. Actually, let me show you one cool thing, you know. This bus has the electronic doors. As Longe said, we're right in the bunk area. I get the driver's side front bottom bunk here, and uh, I like to keep some of my personal belongings, you know, close. I have my toiletries, but uh, I know that you at home, you're probably viewing this uh, on a random day, but you've caught us on a weekend, and uh, we're getting ready, big weekend. I'm a huge Broncos fan, I was born in Denver, Colorado, so I'm getting ready for game day. Ryan Key on the, on the Saturday, he's over here. Uh, a Georgia fan through and through, and so he's got everything color coded. And then, of course, Ryan Mendez. They're on strike right now, you know, they're the, the NHL lockout, but he's a Red Wings through and through. Um, and then we look over here on the far side, we got a little personal pouch. I got my contact case, gotta keep it close. And then I have the, uh, the sunglass collection as well as the pajamas laid out for bed. When you're done with the show and you start to crash, you, you, you gotta just run into bed. So. So I am prepared for uh, for all circumstances right here, driver, front, uh, bottom bunk. This is our back lounge. This is where the magic happens. This is the chill out lounge. This is where our production manager and uh, tour manager like to do their business and work at the end of the day of work. You have your desk here. You've got two TVs so you don't have to break your neck trying to watch one or the other. Stereo system. and. This actually pulls out into a bed, so if you have extra guests on board, it actually comes out and it forms a nice leather bed. I'm glad that you came into the uh, the living room here. This is a coveted second place trophy here from the Vans Warped Tour uh, bowling, charity bowling event. This would have come in first place. My girlfriend got a bowling ball dropped on her foot and I had to leave early. We're pretty proud of that. This is, we're in November now, but we've, we've carried it with us uh, since Warped Tour. So it's, uh, it's part of the family. So I think that thing will probably be on every bus from here out. Oh yeah. We got a brand new toilet on this tour. We did, we got nice. a brand new toilet. Somebody broke the toilet, so we were fortunate enough to get a brand new one. It's quite I remember when I woke up that morning, you know, it's trying to get ready for the morning pee, and it was like, uh, It's quite an investment, but yeah. when you see a pearly white throne, it's like, <laughs> man, we are we're really moving it's up. It's the little things, you know? Yeah. Slide out and a brand new toilet, yellow card, we are moving up in the world. 